Okay, so I wanted to make a video about the sights on my carry pistol. Let's start off with what they are. The rear sight is a serrated all black way of the gun sight from Frank Proctor. It's the square notch version. And the front is an Ameriglow white dot with tritium insert. Um, again, the, uh, the back is 0.125 inches wide and the front is 0.125 inches wide. And um, during the day, you can be very accurate with these uh, due to the small amount of light gap on both sides of the front sight. But also you can be quick with these because all you do is put this white dot in the rear notch and shoot. So um, I like this setup. The reason that I went away from the fiber optic was um, that was very hard to pick up during lower light, uh, dusk type, or early morning lighting conditions. And this white dot, I could still see it. I can still pick it up um, fairly dark. And when it's very dark, the tritium illuminates. And uh, you can see that now, there's still no tritium in the rear. But I think it's good enough. And I would have rather had a tritium in the rear. But the other option that I was looking at was the Heine Slant Pros. And those had similar measurements, but there was no ledge for manipulations. Now the ledge pros had what I wanted, but the rear notch was wider than 0.125 inches. So this is what I have on here now, and um, I like the way this is working out. I can shoot fairly accurate, I'm getting about 100% um, accuracy on a IDPA target at 100 yards, and I'm able to shoot fairly quick and picking up that white dot. And uh, if I was going to carry a weapon light 24-7, I would have definitely kept with the, you know, I would have stuck with the red fiber optic, but I don't because it makes the gun larger and I carry inside the waistband. Now, if I ever do decide to have a dedicated weapon light 24-7, I will probably swap these out to red fiber optic, but that is not the case now, so this is what I'm going with. All right, I uh, hope this helps. Um, if I change anything, I'll let you guys know. And um, these have been the sights that have been on my gun since I started the channel. So anytime you see a, uh, a Glock 19 shooting, it's gonna be with these sights. And um, that's about all I have. So have a good night.